I was thinking, you know, after his request, you know, I've only really had a uh, request for a Jemmy not seed before. And I'm thinking, the more I think about it, it's not such a bad idea actually, because as I said, I came across this seat for the very first time last year. And um, yeah, it was uh, around about the 29th of October. And first of all, we thought, you know, there was uh, what, 80 to uh, 120,000 plants here. So, uh, yeah, well, you can see it's still quite wet there. Damn, oh, the old, the old glid there. So hopefully by, and then we uh, looked towards the end of the season and it all dried out and, it, and the soil pulled away from the ground and broke the roots and everything. So basically there was no plants surviving here over summer. So all these plants, if they do come back by the 29th of October, they've all got to come back from seed. And I'm thinking, well, that's not a bad idea then. If you collect seed, you know it's going to germinate really well. You know it's going to grow really fast. There's a few fans of visuals there. And I'm just looking out for, uh, oh, there's one. There's a pygmy there. There's another few there. So yeah, they're, they're growing. But I'll keep an eye on these and look for the flower stalks. But as I said, they've got a long way to go because we're like mid-September and the 29th of October is uh, about two weeks past the mid of October. So you've got another six weeks to go before they get to the stage when I first discovered it. But uh, I, oh yeah, yeah, lots of them there, all germinating. So uh, yes, so this way we'll also get a view of how quickly do they grow in the wild in their natural setting. And then I was thinking Sean could actually, uh, you know, if he's got grow lights and things like that in his tank, he can manipulate the season sort of thing. And since they're quite used to uh, germinating, growing very rapidly, you might have the opportunity to, to hybridise maybe Pygmy with a, uh, oh, some orchids there, another member of the, um, so the Pedialaris complex, because, uh, you know, I, I got this idea that they might actually be related, you know, pets are just giant pygmies and pygmies are just small pets sort of thing. Whether that turns out to be true or not, I don't know, but it's just an idea. Or, or maybe try and hybridise it with, with the glandulizer seed I'm going to send him, so, you know. Anyway, I think I'm going to get just a short clip here and go down to the other, the other wet patch up.